that comes at a time that this is increasingly important for everyone, including young people, um, to just hear it validated by the Attorney General of the province and the Premier that their privacy and their dignity matter um, and that people do really care about having mechanisms for dealing with this kind of harm. Um, and then the, the announcement of the legislation to allow the province to um, potentially consider litigation against social media companies due mm -hmm. to their addictive algorithms, I thought was really interesting. And it was said in the conference, but, you know, it does track with what some states have been doing, like some litigation in the United States um, and elsewhere to try to deal with the very real harms that arise from, you know, things including addictive algorithms and the kind of information you can receive as a result of those. Mm -hmm. um, and it, yeah, I mean, it was said, but BC has tended to be a leader on both of these types of issues. And so it was, it was really interesting. And I think timing wise, um, really relevant to hear that coming today. I, I'm saying that specifically in relation to the news that broke the other day about deep fake intimate images created of Taylor Swift. Mm -hmm. um, and then we had other news stories, of course, over the past months of that kind of thing happening in Canada as well.